What's good everybody? My name is Jay Fatty. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to talk about Image Line Remote. Okay, so let's get right into it. Now, Image Line Remote is a cool app that you can get on iOS and Android from the App Store, and it lets you control FL Studio with your phone. It essentially acts as a MIDI controller for your phone, okay? So what you're going to want to do is download the app. I'm going to pull up my phone screen right here at the bottom right so you can see it. We're going to want to pull up the app, and then on FL Studio, we're going to want to go to Options, MIDI Settings, and then turn on Im Enable Image Line Remote down here. You also want to make sure that you're connected to your Wi-Fi on your phone and on your computer. All right. And then on the phone, you click on tap to connect on FL Studio. And then it should connect. Now, this main section lets you go into song and pattern mode, lets you go play and pause it. You can stop. You can record. You can put the metronome on and off. You can mess with the tempo. You can tap the tempo to get a tempo that you want. You see up here at the tempo, it is now moving while I'm tapping this. You can wait for input. You can overdub, loop record, step edit. You can show playlist, show sequencer, piano roll, browser, mixer, and settings. We also have this tempo knob right here where we could just change the tempo by moving this. Up at the top here, if we click on piano, it'll bring up a keyboard for us to play. We can use this little knob right here to switch between our inserts in the channel rack. Well, we're on the FL keys right now. Let's just hit a A minor chord. Obviously, this, this would be a lot better on like an iPad or something that has a bigger screen, but it can do some wonders on your phone as well. You got a pitch slider, mod one and mod two here. You can mess with this as well. If we go into FPC. You have stuff for FPC, but we don't have FPC pulled up in FL Studio. So let's just do that real quick. Let's pull it up. And it's going to pull up the same default pattern that's in FPC. So I could just do some finger drumming with my phone right now. If you go to the, the Harmony tab on the app, It'll show you a bunch of different chords or notes, and you can just hit those notes inside this big, like, square display of notes instead of playing it on a piano. You also got Slice X and your performance mode. So you can do a lot of stuff in here. You can also mix inside this. So I would definitely recommend this. It has some really cool features to let you mess with FL Studio on your phone and control it on your phone. It'd be really cool in recording sessions and all of that. That's pretty much it. If this video brought you value, please leave a like, hit subscribe, and hit the little bell. Make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, y'all. Peace.